Hey everybody and welcome back to American Truck Simulator. We are here in uh, Spokane, Washington, right where we left off yesterday. Trying to pick up a load and see what else we can explore here in the great state of Washington. And if we have any cool loads going anywhere, well, we do have a couple loads. We've got one to Kennewick. Got a couple loads to Kennewick. And I've got a special transport, actually, to Grand Coulee. So I'm kind of thinking about the Kennewick load. Because I'm worried the special transport is going to kick us into night. Where was that at? There it is. Just a couple trucks to Kennewick. Let's go ahead and take that. Now, we were talking yesterday about there being a mod for Arnold Schwarzenegger's uh, reading us or giving us vocal directions. I looked in the Steam Workshop. I couldn't find it. Um, but I did add the uh, the Google Google Navigation mod in. So we won't have Granny. We won't have, we won't have Granny giving us directions. We're going to have the Google, good old plain boring Google Voice Nav giving us directions. Let's go ahead and go ahead and fuel up while we're here. Wait, this garage not have fuel. What these garages had fuel? Maybe they don't. The old garages had fuel right over there. Oh well. We'll get fuel. Navigation resumed. I'm glad navigation has been Continue resumed. Straight. Well, we will. I went this way just because we hadn't driven on this road. Use I wanted, the to, left lane. wanted to expose it. Use the left lane, then turn left. Navigation resumed. Navigation resumed. Navigation resumed. Navigation oh, resumed. I'm going down the wrong way street. Navigation resumed. <laughs> wrong Navigation way. Navigation resumed. Wrong way. <laughs> Navigation resumed. Turn left. They need to tell me I'm going down the wrong way. Me, just drive the wrong way. All right, go earn some more money. Turn left. Turn left. Use the right lane, then take the exit on the right. Uh, you're a little late giving me that. I think I'm not going very quick. Hey guys, I did want to mention uh, that I put some information at the top of the description. Uh, I am a driver in the Delta Bravo virtual trucking company. 
and uh, you can too join the Delta Bravo Virtual Trucking Company should you so wish. He just so happens to be starting effective tomorrow a 30 in 30 um, competition or I guess uh, potential giveaway for his virtual trucking company drivers. Uh, basically what that is is if you do um, at least 30 drive 30 um, 30 drives, 30 deliveries, I guess we'll call them deliveries, right? If you do 30 deliveries over the course of the next 30 days, starting tomorrow, uh, you'll be entered into a drawing for $20 Canadian uh, Steam Cash uh, to be uh, basically uh, given out to one of his virtual company trucking drivers. Uh, that has completed 30 loads within the next 30 days. Not very hard at all. Uh, I've checked and I've already completed 30 loads. Sadly though, I've done 30 loads before the uh, competition starts. So if I'm going to be eligible, I need to do another 30 starting tomorrow. Think about it, it's not that too hard. It doesn't have any restrictions on the jobs needing to be a specific length. Um, are a specific type of job do a whole bunch of little short jobs and probably be done in the period of two or three days or if you are the long haul guy you could probably do 30 long hauls once a day and uh, and spread it out and earn yourself a good bit of cash um, but virtual trucking company is a fun thing to do all the information is there on his website so I encourage you to go check it out if you're somebody that does uh, American Truck Simulator and you're not already in a virtual trucking company, go ahead and check it out. Some interesting farmland over here. Winding railroad track through there. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, what do we got? What do we got? Got a bus? What are they doing? Making bus stops? Are these school buses going like 25 miles an hour? Use the right lane. Uh oh. Uh oh. You're good. Two lane exit. You didn't tell me to stay in the left lane, lady. It's voice nav if you don't tell me where to go. Granny at least wouldn't stop talking. Check and see how our money amount. Yeah, we are we're running a little low on funds because after the stream, went ahead and bought a driver, hired a driver and another truck. And since I remembered, I didn't have to actually be at the garage to buy it. We don't really need to buy up the garages as we drive to them and uh, just go to our real estate screen and buy those later as we have money. That's a really cool feature. I know like in uh, multiplayer, you might say, okay, let's all meet up at uh, XYZ City. Um, usually those cities have garages in them and you might be like oh I don't have that garage and I'm halfway across the map in a completely different state I'm gonna have to drive there it's gonna take me hours of game time to get there to meet up with you guys but if you got the money 
by the garage, quick travel there, and uh, be part of the crew a lot faster. So I really like that feature. And you guys are quiet tonight. Makes me think I'm just talking to myself. Navigation resumed. At least we're not rerouting. Oh, you just drove through the barrier, dude. That was a pretty quick trip. A few miles out already. Use the left lane. All right, I will Use indeed. The left lane. I am in the left lane, lady. You not know you're left and right. Use the left lane, then turn left. Turn left. Check out that bridge. In 200 meters, turn left. 200 meters? Turn left. What are you measuring meters? Measuring feet. What's wrong with you, lady? You have arrived. All right, well, that was a quick trip. Horn. What's going on? My truck's not uniform. All right, let's go ahead and see what we have. Offer at Kennewick. Fertilizer, double O, the wrong state. Nothing, freight market. Oh, Bell Bellingham. I think we've been to Bellingham, have we? Do home accessories to Bellingham. Let's check and see what the normal freight market has for Kennewick. 
Seattle, there's our home accessories. Internal contracts. Olympia. Haven't been there, so that'll be a good trip to take. Yakima. Back to Spokane. All these are going to be higher priced. They're going to be outside the state. I like to sort mine by price. We are in Great Market and Kennewick. Accessories. Do it. Food. We're gonna have to go. Whoa, buddy. Do this. I'm going to see if I can go, if I can go the other way and get there. I can. So that way to get to Kennewick. In fact, we're then going to here. There we go. We're going to come up here. That road. Get this, uh, got a truck dealer up here too. We'll have to check out once we get up there. What are we hauling again? Home accessories, 42,000 pounds. Do Walbert. And just under $15,000. Turn left. Turn left. Brakes are bad. Hey! Hey! You stopped. Let me go. Totally stopped. Let me go.
who out there has Washington or the uh, the Forestry Machines DLC? What do you guys think of it? Paddle boat there. Use the right lane. My sunglasses on. Larry. Use the left lane, then turn left. No, uh, we're just gonna stay straight. Turn left. Navigation resumed. I just picked that spot so we could uh, come through the city here. Continue straight. Use the right lane, then take the exit on the right. Do we? Take the exit on the right. Be able to hammer this down a little bit more. Here. We got hops. Got hops growing over here. Let me check something. Hold on. Hold on real quick. Check something out. Oh my gosh. I've been missing chat the whole dang time. A whole bunch of messages I've been missing. For some reason. I wasn't seeing anybody chat, so I just refreshed it. Now I'm seeing people chat. And look, then old guy goes and leaves on me. After I just realized that I haven't been seeing anybody chat. Hey, Delta Bravo. What's up? Hey, Darren. I saw a Doughboy there earlier. Said my chat window was showing absolutely nothing. Here talking to myself, wondering why people were saying anything. Hey, David, what's up? This trailer's a little top heavy, I can feel it. Roll me over. Did I miss anything important? Oh, 
Have you had a chance to uh, get into it? What do you think? I didn't miss that. I caught it. I figured that part out. Did anybody say they preferred the old granny GPS over uh, boring Google? It's been 26 minutes, not 67. I don't know if you were here for me pimping your dry, your trucking company. I pimped it. Uh, okay. That was right at the start. I'll, I'll pimp it again in about 15 minutes. Uh, I got rid of the stuff. I got rid of the old granny. I was going to put Arnold in, but I couldn't find him in the Steam Workshop. So we put in just boring Google Nav. This is a, that is definitely a rollover corner there. Now I got uh, boring GPS, boring uh, Google lady. About to talk to you. Use the right lane, then take the exit on the right. Hey, Take Douglas. The exit on the right. Is that a different one or is that the raspy voice? I had the raspy voice yesterday. Turn right. We'll pull in here to hearts. Use Get some the gas. Left lane, then turn left. Turn left. I think this is funny because there's a Love's truck stop um, here in the U.S. They've just called it Hearts. Oh yes, Bert the Legend, there is a speed limit. And the police will pull you over. Well they don't know they give you tickets, they don't actually pull you over. I on the other hand turned that off. Oh, well, we might as well rest. Might as well rest while we're here. Oh, in real life. Yeah, I've been pulled over plenty of times.
do all my law breaking in ATS now. Hey, John Deere, Boy, Eagle, what's up? Uh, live in, uh, in Washington? Uh, Delta, it's easy. Just uh, just marry someone that's in the police. Then, then you don't have to worry about it. Turn, go down, top heavy haul. Look at it leaning back there. Definitely roll me over. A little disappointed. Well, you know, I've been, I've been restricting myself to just, just you know, in-state runs, but been a little disappointed in not seeing. Um, not seeing very many uh, forestry machine um, jobs. Again, been limiting myself to uh, just running within the state. No, I'm not going to show you a rollover. Leave that up to Delta Bravo next time he's over on Twitch. Hey, Gustavo, what's up? Dropping by? <laughs> well, I'm trying to hit all, this, all the cities. I assume maybe there's more forestry loads in, um, in other cities. look uh, we turn track and fin traffic offenses off um, road events detours and rain is turned off uh, truck stability is I guess all the way to the right I don't know if that means super stable or what. Trailer stability is all the way to the right and suspension stiffness is all the way to the right. Oh, this was a cool feature they added. Secondary names. So if you do, uh, if your language is something other than English, and you check this, you'll get the name in English of the city as well as the name in your language of choice. Uh, 
Uh, so I have the most stable option. That. Uh, I like I like Washington, yeah. I like Oregon. This is a lot like Oregon. I like the trees, I like the more windy roads. I like the fact that uh, lots of the roads are not um, just multi-lane interstates. Uh, I don't know, it's just what I run. I don't think I've run anything else. down there. That is a view. Fast running river. That's the road. The road that's doubling back. Speaking of Bill Gates, I saw, I saw a funny video of him and Warren Buffett uh, doing a shift at Dairy Queen. That was a hoot. Uh, the wife didn't think it was so funny. I thought it was hilarious. She just, yeah, she has an interesting uh, sense of humor that obviously that didn't, uh, that didn't touch. if this is a uh... no, I don't think we can go that way all right Delta you go uh, load up some cargo ships all right did you know you can get a new cargo trailer now? So you can haul uh, cargo containers around. But now that Delta's leaving, I will uh, talk again about his uh, virtual trucking company. So, uh, Delta, starting tomorrow, is doing a 30 for 30 in his virtual trucking company. Uh, 
Uh, there's a link in my description to his website with all the details. Basically what it is, is uh, you sign up to be a driver in his virtual trucking company, install a little app on your PC, uh, you let it run while you're in ATS, and basically it logs your, your loads, uploads it to the trucking company's website, and his competition or his challenge for his drivers is to do 30 runs in the next 30 days starting tomorrow um, so that's June what is it 13th through July 12th or 13th or something and for any virtual trucker who drives 30 and 30 uh, you'll be entered into a possible drawing of 20 Canadian dollars steam credit uh, so that's something if you're looking for a little cash like playing ATS, then you might want to join, just for funsies, uh, a virtual trucking company. If you're not already in one, go ahead and take a look at the Delta Bravo link, top of the description. Use the right lane. Um, take a look at the details. They are in Everett. Heading north to uh, whatever that city is we're going to. Zoom that out. Get on some of these bridges that go up and rotate. That'll be. There's a ferry too we need to get in. What? Gotta go into this one too. Navigation resumed. Oh. Too far. We gotta figure out once we deliver this load we gotta figure out what city uh, we need to be into to get on the ferry it's actually a ferry you have to get into in order to I guess go across the bay the sound whatever you want to call it in order to get to a little island I think well, I like New states. There's all kinds of new things to explore, new things that they implement, like these uh, digital display boards over the uh, roads. minutes. State Street and Iowa Street. Billing, Billingham, that's where we're going. Use the right lane, then take the exit on the right. Take the exit on the right. 
Use the left lane, then turn left. Bellingham discovered, so that's 10 of 16 cities. We got six more cities to discover. Turn left. And there's a uh, truck dealer over there we gotta find. Wonder if those reflect. They do. Make those reflect. Your lights are on. Continue straight. Right. Let me go. Let me go. Must have a lot of fog up here. Use the right lane, then turn right. Have those uh, reflectors all over the road. Turn right. Oh, check out that mural. You're on the side of the on the building, and then kind of a rocket ship. Yeah, I got tired of the verbal abuse, Roy. Park over there. In 200 meters, turn right. We don't talk about meters here in the U.S. Turn right. Not an American Google Voice. to British Columbia. Apparently ProMods is doing a uh, doing a uh, Canada add-on. Use the right lane, then turn right. No, we shouldn't. We need to be different. Turn right. Makes us feel better about ourselves. Turn left. You have arrived. Oh, we've arrived. Oh, look. Somehow we have to park the truck that way with the, uh, with the truck um, up in the air like that?
Almost. Almost did it. Give it to me. Bonus. That's the island. I think we need to get over here to Port Angles to get over to that. I go to Tacoma no, still, Port Angles, Aberdeen, Longview, Grand Coulier, and Colview. Omar, we've already been there. Port Angles, that's where we're going. Hope we can go on a ferry. Turn right, then turn left. Turn left. Dots are bumpy. Winnebago. In 200 meters, turn left. Turn left. <laughs> Let's walk up the walk up the brakes. Turn left. You have arrived. Oh, we got a little, uh, little loader over there moving logs. You have arrived. Journal contract. Uh, what happened? I clicked the wrong one. Or did it change? It changed on us. Take that one. So I'll go to tidbit. Tidbit.
Navigation resumed. Turn left. Right over there. In Pacific. Turn right. In 200 meters, turn right. Almost put the mod in that does uh, intermittent, intermittent uh, long trains. Thanks for the sub, Alex. Turn right. You have arrived. Huh, we've arrived. Here's our load. Right. The one of the part these huge doubles right next to the wall. There we go, we got out of there. We haul in meat. Turn right. Little dots. Anyone else ridden the ferry? In two hundred meters, Fort turn Anglis. left. Turn left. What are you doing? In two hundred meters, turn right. Turn right. through town use the left lane then turn left oh look at that you run into me buddy only run in a red light pay attention turn left I am headed I thought you were going to work going to Port Angeles Oh, I do have to take the ferry. Look at that. Look at that. We're going to take the ferry. There's a short light. Wait in here, let's look around. Got luckies. 
restaurant, Blackie's restaurant. Like a market over there. There's the guy that hit me. Washington University. Yoga studio. Got a yoga studio over there. I don't know how that dispatch job works. Have you done it before? Use the right lane, then turn right. Turn right. All right, hold on. Why does she have an echo? Oh, maybe because uh, maybe the volume is uh, turned up. So I don't have game sound coming through my ears. I have game sound coming out of um, my PC speaker. I'll open Truckbook's client. I go to Dispatcher. I accept pork anglies to Cloville. Now what? Select the profile for delivery. Let's close. Oh, I gotta close the game out before. It says close game out before adding delivery or something. So, I guess the mic is picking up her over the PC speakers. And then, of course, I'm piping game sound into the stream. Navigation resumed. So, maybe that's what it is. Turn right. Navigation resumed. Yeah, I think it said close game out before accepting load. Then I guess when it loads up the game, it injects that load into uh, into my game. Use the left lane. Oh, okay, John. Well, what I've got is. I use a noise gate option in OBS to basically mute my mic if I'm not talking. So if I talk quiet, then I might talk and occasionally, um, occasionally, you know, it'll, the mic will cut out. But what that does mean use is the when right I'm lane, then take the exit on the right. When I'm not talking, then. Uh, Mic is muted unless background sound the right. is above a specific level. So that's what's Use going the on left there. Lane, then turn left. Turn left. I think I was talking with Dirty Tractor Doctor about dispatch, and he was saying 
basically you had to yeah he was saying you had to exit and come back in every time you wanted to get a new load but what you could do is you could set up let's say a convoy and you could give everybody jobs from a specific location to a specific location and then you know everybody has at least the first run Very. Here in Coopsville. Use the left lane, then turn left. Ooh. Turn left. Turn left. Uh, you, you are a little crazy, lady. This is right. in here oh what a hit truck Enter to view possible destinations. Hundred dollars. You're gonna charge me a hundred dollars. Get over here. When I gotta get over here for a job, I better get reimbursed for this. But what this does do is it now like they could do this as an add-on at some point, and then you could pick a different destination. Navigation resume. Oh, we don't get to see it. Look, I'm only getting forty nine hundred and ninety dollars. It's forty eight hundred bucks. Oh, achievement fairy tales.
That's pretty cool. Over the Bay Bridge. I don't know. Where's the Bay Bridge? Use the left lane, then turn left. Turn left. Oh. Uh, I don't know. I honestly avoid San Francisco. I don't like California at all. I have a boring state. In 200 meters, turn right. Yeah, that's 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 part of the uh, draw to the game, though, is is the exploration. And with updates, they bring turn in right. new roads. So, like they added with this update, they added a couple more roads to Oregon that weren't there before. Alright, well, I'll have to exit and re-enter the game. It won't take too long. I think it's going to take me to a city that we haven't been to anyway. See what kind of options we have for loads. Angley. Hey. Very cool welcome sign back there. Oh, we forgot to go visit that uh, truck dealer. Right. Use the left lane, then turn left. Turn left. Uh, it's the downside of watching from work, isn't it? Use the right lane. Bit bit. Uh oh. Turn right. You have arrived. All right, but how do you want me to park this thing?
All right, fine. <clears throat> Alrighty. Port Angeles, Alberdeen. Oh, we could take a, a large reservoir tank down to Alberdeen. Backhoe loader. Take that to Tacoma. All right, well, let's exit and let's try, let's try Delta's loadout. Save this. Quit out. And we'll be right back after these messages. Here has been added to my profile. Launch it back up, back up again. Well, the break is over. Ah, oh, market. Now let's see. I wonder how you do this. That's it. No, that's not it. It's an external contract. Go to GPS. Go to drive. I don't know, I've never done a dispatch. Doesn't look like it. Don't have any, uh, don't have any of that. Where were we going? Port Angles to Colville. I don't in in the truck books client it doesn't show a cargo Port Angles to Colville
I don't see it. Wasn't a cargo job, was it? And there's this. We'll take that one. Or is that it? All right. Let's go get our log hauler. That's a good load. Turn left. Use the left lane. Oh, we're going the wrong way. Navigation resumed. We'll just go the wrong way. Take it later, Delta. Thanks for the Use load. Use the left lane, then turn left. Navigation resumed. Navigation resumed. Me and these one-way roads are turn not left. working out very well. In 200 meters, turn left. Hey, Richard, what's up? Use the right lane, then turn right. Turn right. You have arrived. We've arrived. There she is. Uh, you know what? I had, I have track IR, but it stopped working for uh, ATS. I'm not really sure what's up. Here we go. We're gonna haul another tree harvester. Use the left lane, then turn left. Turn left. Straight. When track IR worked, it was great. You know, you turn your head, the whole thing would turn. You can lean forward. Yeah, I guess you could probably just go into your settings, turn uh, detours off, and then uh, you know, get past it and turn them back on. Use the right lane. Guess you could go in also, and uh, maybe with this this dispatch thing. Continue straight. Um. That.
Oh, the, the Viper 389? Is a nice truck. I've stopped running uh, mod trucks just because I, I just use one profile, single and multiplayer. I wonder if this is going to take us back across the ferry. Peterbilt, I think. Whatever the square nose Peterbilt is. like the square nose trucks be better. Oh, okay. Use That's the right lane, then continue straight. It's the Viper Peterbilt 389 in the uh, Steam Workshop. Looks like we are not going to go down the uh, ferry this time around. Yeah, I'm kind of a, I guess I'm kind of a sucker for this old, old blocky look. Squared off news. Got the old lights on it. Yeah, just be aware if you ever want to do, um, if you ever want to do Truckers MP, you're pretty much limited to the in game stuff. There are some mods that will still work that are, that are really client side. Um, so some folks will have multiple profiles, one for multiplayer and one for single. Continue straight. Yeah, because, you know, the game doesn't know what to... The game doesn't, wouldn't know what to render for, for other players when they see your truck. Because the way I understand Truckers MP, it's just a wrapper around your single player game. So it's really, it's really you're playing a single player game, but the wrapper is getting information about other trucks and basically superimposing them on your screen as if they are traffic. Um, so if base game, if your game doesn't have that mod, then it wouldn't be able to render it for you. And it's not like Farm Sim where you log into a, uh, a specific, well you do log into a specific server, but it's it's an open public server. They don't have private servers. But then you would be like, okay, these are the truck options, these are the load options and things. Uh, 
I think you can use some. Probably the uh, the sound packs, maybe. Maybe like real companies and things like that. I usually just run completely vanilla. The only mod I have actually activated at the moment is the uh, GPS voice. Once they update Trucker's MP for the update and the new map, then uh, let's say create an account and try it and see. It'll either tell you that it needs to deactivate them or uh, they'll work. Use the left lane. But what I was what I was getting back to back back in the other city was I wonder if like you could create your own trucking company so that then you had dispatch power and then basically you could map out like I want to run this load from this city to this city then I want to run the load from that city to this other city and just assign yourself like four or five loads from city to city and then you would know that you would definitely have loads you wanted to, the cities you wanted to go to the other cities you wanted Use that'd the be pretty lane. interesting That's the copper. Use the left lane. Uh, that's no problem. I knew when I was getting into Trucker's MP, I had all kinds of questions. So I basically try to remember the questions I had, and now that I know those answers, Use I try, the left to, lane. try to just give you those answers. You don't need to be so annoying about the left lane, lady. Use the left lane. I'm in the left lane. Oh. Good to see we're up to 160 some thousand dollars I passed the wait station deal does it look like I'm using the left lane use the right lane now I have to take the exit on the oh right my gosh why don't you just not give me any warning Jeez, lady. Take the exit on the right. <laughs> uh, yeah. So, odds are Use activated right lane. Uh, per profile, I think. I, I honestly... 
I know it's at the profile screen on the right. It basically says like mod manager. That's where you go in and activate or deactivate mods for the given session. But, you know, I think, I think what you run into is if you have a custom truck, then you deactivate it, and then you save, then your truck's missing. Use Thanks. the left lane. I don't know, maybe it is. I'm going to use and abuse this left lane. Use the right lane. We gotta use the right lane. We have to get off. Use the right lane. Boot ends. Uh, does the warning basically say you're using unauthorized mods or something? Or unauthorized content or something? Got a rest stop coming up down a bit. Oh, okay. You know, if it's not a truck mod, then it'll be fine. It'll just, you know, if it's just scenery. Then you'll just have stock scenery. It won't corrupt anything. Gonna get the bypass, or we're gonna have to stop. I have to stop. Navigation resumed. Totally paused. Totally. The biggest, the biggest disappointment with multiplayer is there isn't 
graphic other than other multiplayer trucks. Navigation resumed. Continue straight. This party started. And thanks to my other drivers, we're up to two hundred nineteen. Got money rolling in like crazy. Twenty-eight thousand. Nice, guys. This is going to be the final run of the Use night. The left lane. Uh, because. I need to finish up a map review or map first impressions video. See if I can't get that finished and edited up tonight so I can uh, do the encoding and the upload overnight for one of the maps that came out today. is a rather interesting map in uh, multiple respects. I know that there is an update for supporters that is kind of a testing update with some fixes uh, I haven't heard uh, the estimated time frame on on general availability of that I've got the update um, I just haven't had time to do anything with it.
That beeping is uh, the truck, the uh, virtual trucking company. Tell me, I'm about to go into what they call racing condition. Uh, David, I think that's actually intended. Because the breeding pigs, the manure spawns uh, inside also. I think it's intended. And the uh, the little you know the, the the classic spawn point. That's just that's been provided there, kind of for you to, uh, to place it into. What do you have for your? Oh, wait, you already told me you've got one of the uh, more rounded ones. I was going to ask you if you had a Volvo. Uh, GTX, if you're still there, I saw your, um, saw your, three of your mods got updated today. The, uh, the, the, um, workshop trailer. And, uh, it now works with, uh, the, uh, workshop tabber. That's nice. Ran into that, the, uh, I think when we were doing a Hoff Bergman stream, wanted to uh, wanted to tab over it and uh, do like a repair of the header and of the harvester, and couldn't do it. But now we'll be able to update that, and that'll work. Quite interesting how the western part of the state and the eastern part of the state look drastically different. Now we're kind of moving more into this flatlands, rocky, a bit more desolate looking. You're much more um, pine trees and mountainous and hilly on the uh, western part the eastern part is more flat and uh, rocky and more kind of more what you expect out of uh, Arizona and uh, Nevada and such well everybody makes a couple mistakes Oh, I saw that. I saw the uh, use the left lane. Saw the other one. You have the milk area you told me about. I never really noticed the issue. Was the uh, the milking stand selling stand? Was that maybe like recessed into the building too much or something?
Use the right lane, then take the exit on the right. Oh, take no. the exit on the right. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, I just tested with the small pin too. Continue straight. Little shepherds in. Continue straight. Arcade. Convention center. Check that out. So hard to think of and test everything, isn't it? Continue Volvo straight. dealer. Navigation resumed. Make a U turn. Navigation resumed. Turn right. Kenworth uh, Dealers, Portland, Elko, Los Angeles, Phoenix, there's others, Hobbs, there's others that I haven't, uh, found I don't know what's up here in Bellingham and Tacoma I don't know what's over here in San Francisco Yuma or Tucson Portland is Kenworth, Volvo's Eugene, and Peterbilt's Medford. Turn right. World's most happy cattle. They don't look too happy in that sign. He doesn't look very happy. Yeah, once you have so many, well, I think once you have two trucks. You can buy online. You don't have to actually go to a dealer.
Okay, three. Yeah, I don't. I don't remember. Whoa. In two hundred meters, turn right. Turn right. Level Lane Ranch. And themselves a tree harvester. Oh no, they got some bales falling around on the ground. Gotta keep working our way around. See the marker yet? Still further up here. This is a pretty cool area to deliver into. I'm glad I'm not bottoming out. You have arrived. Oh, I have arrived. All right. Good money, too. Spokane, anything to Spokane. Wrong one. Oldville to Spokane. Get one. Frozen fruits. All terrain crane. Well, guys, that's going to do us for the night. I'm going to uh, hire a driver before we close out. Truck dealer.
Fine. We got the cheapest truck we got. Do another one. Do one more. Recruitment agent. All right, that'll do us. You're an all-female trucking company. Yeah, I just buy base trucks. I don't have a. Uh, like I said I don't have any mods in. I don't. I don't change. I don't change any of the trucks, other than the one I'm driving. But most are five seven nines. Occasionally, I pick. Kenworth is a dealer, and I just get the W900 for all. Base, unpainted, trucks. I could do this, copy, config. There's a way to, to copy a config from all trucks to uh, one truck to all trucks. Uh, yeah, I just buy base stuff. All right, guys, that's going to do us. Not sure what we're going to do tomorrow. Um, but we'll figure it out. So until next time, happy trucking.